Hi there, I've got some awesome news to share in this video. It's about a cool feature I managed to pull off in Flutterflow. Something a lot of you have been asking about. So I've been digging deep into all things Flutterflow, checking out tons of courses and lessons. Guess what? I didn't find anything like what I've just created. Sure, there are some tutorials out there showing similar stuff in apps like Flutter, but they usually need extra apps and emulators to work. Here is the kicker with my project. It's all done straight in Flutterflow. No extra apps, no emulators, nothing. And the coolest part, you can test it right there in Flutterflow and it works fine and it works like a charm. Now let's talk about what this feature is all about. It's real-time online tracker on Google Maps, made for keeping an eye on a delivery boy in a full delivery application. You know, for those times when you are waiting for your food to arrive, this feature lets customers see exactly where the delivery person is on Google Maps. Right inside the application, they get live updates as their food makes its way to them. It's all about making the delivery experience more transparent and engaging. Can it wait for you all to try it out? So first, I want to show you a video, a shot with my phone while in the car where you can see how the location tracker on Google Maps in Flutterflow works in real time. I apologize in advance if the video isn't top quality, but I think you'll get the idea. Thank you. Ciao. In this video, you see my iPad where I have opened the Flutterflow file. I press the start button and the system determines my location, which immediately appears on the screen. The top marker represents my position, meaning the driver's location, while the bottom marker is the address I entered into the database, the customer address. Now you can see the marker start to move. It turns and moves along with me towards the destination. Now you can see how the marker turned left along with me. When I arrive at the target location, I'll click the stop button and it will stop. Делаем confirmation, что мы принесли продукт. Нажимаем и все, остановили. So, you've seen how it works in real-time live tracking mode. I want to say again that everything was done within Flutterflow. I didn't use any external application. It's all done inside Flutterflow using its own tools and without any custom functions. You can obtain and download the file from the URL in the description. I wish everyone success and if you have any questions, feel free to write to me. I'll try to respond to everyone. Thank you.